Hey, what's up you guys? Shardimus Prime here, doing a P.O. Box Pickups video slash Jazzwares unboxing slash BBTS unboxing video. And first off, I wanted to mention to you guys that at this very moment in time, right now, I am actually driving on my way to San Diego uh, for San Diego Comic Con 2019. I hope to see you guys there. I'll be going with Century Productions and Rodine, and unfortunately the lovely Charlita one and the babies are not coming along, so uh, it'll just be me and the two dudes. Uh, very unfortunate that Charlita one can't go, uh, but we were able to go to uh, WonderCon earlier this year, so that was kind of like an appetizer to make up for her missing out on the big main course of San Diego Comic Con. So I feel bad that she's not gonna be going there, but I'm gonna keep her in mind and be taking pictures for her and sending her stuff. So, uh, on to the P.O. Box. Oh, and I also wanted to mention that if you want to come by and say hi, or if you wanted to meet, I will most likely be at the Hasbro Marvel booth a lot. Like every year at San Diego Comic Con, that's like my home base spot to go to is the Marvel Legends, is I'm just always there at the Hasbro Marvel booth, always checking them out. I never get tired of looking at the new figures behind the glass. So yeah, so if you want to, you know, stop by, say hi, uh, check me out over there. If you catch me doing an interview or something, uh, please hold off for a second, and then I'll gladly uh, chat and take pics and stuff like that. Very fun thing to do. Uh, all right, so let's get to the P.O. Box stuff first. And right over here we have, this is from uh, Love It Town, New York. There's no name. And we get, ooh, nice little image of Shardimus Prime right there on the back. That's what it looked like to me anyway. And I have some other reviews coming up later this week. I'm going to spend today, today's actually Tuesday while I'm recording this, but the video's going up Wednesday. So I'm going to try to spend the rest of the day recording videos for Thursday, Friday, Saturday. If I can pull it off, we'll see. You may just see more STCC footage. And why does my camera keep doing this thing? All right, anyway, so it says, Dear Shardimus, my name is Andrew and I'm 11 years old. I'm a big fan of your videos. Thank you so much. I collect Marvel Legends as well. I love the big time let down Spider-Man stop motions. Thank you so much. And uh, you inspired me to collect Marvel Legends. And my first figures were the Hulk and Hulkbuster 2-pack from Marvel Studios, the first 10 years series. I have been watching your channel for about a year now. Your reviews are very helpful to watch before getting a figure. I have my own channel called Comedy Episode Prime. I hope you enjoy my my short art and keep up the good work. Awesome. Nice, man. Wow. 11 years old. Jeez. Yeah, pretty smart kid, too. You use the uh, type, use the computer typewriter. He used the computer right there, so I didn't have to read the bad penmanship. Assuming that he has bad penmanship, I know I do, but anyway, that's an awesome looking stealth suit Spider Man. I really do that. I like the stealth suit Spider Man, by the way. I thought it was awesome. Uh, at first, I was skeptical towards it, but knowing that it's a shield suit, I mean, that's basically what it is. This right here is from Gabe from Virginia, and we get a big time draw, uh, bleh, drawn from memory. Clearly, it's horrible. Ah, it's not so bad. Well, I mean, it should be kind of a letdown, right? I mean, is that what you're going for, right? No, 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 no. But uh, did you guys notice that uh, Peter says big time in the Spider-Man Far From Home movie? I don't know. I'm just saying. I'm just hoping. I got a nod, an honorable mention, uh, you know, with the Into the Spider-Verse movie. So, you know, now my head's all uh, inflated with uh, hoping that in an actual Spider-Man movie there's like a little nod to me. Any anyway, let's get back to reality, folks. And by folks, I mean me. Hey, Shardimus! Thank you for using the Marvel Titan Hero Series Big Time Spidey in the Mysterio Review. Thank you so much for the figure, man. And I also think Marvel Legends should make a new Jigsaw figure and a Blob and uh, Toad 2-pack. Ooh, definitely need a new Toad figure. I like that Blob figure, though. I, I think it's a dope figure. By the way, this shelf is getting totally redone, by the way. I'm going to have it just be Avengers Villains. I hate looking at how that looks like a mess. It bothers me. Anyway, uh, by the way, love the Far From Home Wave reviews. Thank you so much. It says, P.S. New Scarlet Witch uh, figure looks like Charlita 1. Does it, though? I don't... Uh, that's a very nice thing to say, because I think that, that head sculpt is beautiful, but there's that right there. Okay. And then, uh, let's get on to the next piece of artwork that we have in here. Oh, look at that! Spider Stan! Rest in peace, Stan Lee, 1922-2018. Oh, man, that's so cool. Spider Stan. I love it. That is awesome. That is excellent. Ah, so sad no Stan Lee this year. Or ever again. Alright, so, uh, this is... I'm just so used to Stan Lee being at Comic-Con, and, uh, yeah, so it's just, it's just sad. But anyway, um... I did, I think I did, I, I did see him at his last Comic-Con appearance, I think that was 2018, I think he was there the same year, uh, 
that he passed away, if, if I don't remember correctly. You know, I'm fairly certain. Anyway, this is from Jeffrey from Illinois. You know, open, 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 and, okay. This is a letter that says, Dear Shardimus Prime, I'm a big fan of your collection. It's amazing. Oh, thank you for liking the collection. It makes me think that collecting action figures is fun. It is! Uh, unless Hasbro releases 50,000 figures all at the same time, and you got bills to pay, and all kinds of stuff to do, and you're like, oh my god, I'm gonna get all these figures. <sighs> Easy. I'm gonna review them all. Just, just, got, just takes a little bit of time, so stay tuned with me. Hang in there for the best action figure reviews in the observable universe from the one and only Shardimus Prime, Shardimus Prime, if I could say the name right. Anyway, I'm a big fan, and I actually got a decent amount of sleep last night, just saying, and I still can't talk. All right, I'm a big fan of your collection. It's amazing. Thank you. It makes me think. Oh, yeah, fun. Uh, I love your big time letdown Spider-Man stop motion videos. Thank you so much. And then it says, keep up the good work, or keep up the hard work. Thank you. Uh, sincerely, Jeffrey P.S. I'm a Spider-Man. Oh, thank you so much. Cool. Right on, Jeffrey. We're both Spider-Man fans. Excellent. All right, let's get to the unboxing video. Oh, wait. Uh, if you guys want to send your letters and artwork, please go ahead and do so. Shardness Prime, P.O. Box 384, Pacifica, California, 94044. If I get it in hand, I read it in the video. So go ahead and send one over. Let's go ahead and get to the... Which one? Uh, let's do the BBTS unboxing first. All right. Hold on. And... Uh, 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 we're gonna, uh, okay. Just gotta rip a couple of things off of here and here because I don't know. I love you guys, but I'm not really down to give you my home address yet. We're not that close yet. Okay, so this is a big, big, big box from BBTS. So if you wanna go ahead and pick up your figures, you can do so at Big Bad Toy Store. So, uh, and, uh, all right, it, it, it. open it up on this side. I don't wanna damage anything. I will not be reviewing any of this stuff before I leave for San Diego Comic Con, just so you guys know, but I really wish I could. A lot of goodies in here, if I remember right. And... Ugh, ugh. Okay, so... Let's get this big one out of the way here first. Now, Big Bad Toy Store has these incredible deals going on right now, which I really like. They have like these one-week deals and one-day deals that are awesome. So check them out in two-day deals. It's week-long, weekend. Like you should check them out frequently. But this was not any one of those deals. This was a Hot Toys Black Panther. It was a Hot Toys Black. This is the Hot Toys Black Panther figure. And I'm gonna go ahead and take them out of the shipper box right here just because I want to get a closer look at. It. Take a look at the packaging right here. You know what I mean? Sorry for hot toys. I haven't, I haven't reviewed a hot toy figure in a little bit, so getting, getting the itch. But I've been wanting to review this for quite some time already, and I love that it comes with the Bozeman head sculpt. So yeah, that's looking pretty cool. Still in the plastic right there, but you'll see a review of that uh, in a little while because uh, the new Comic Con is coming up. So can't wait to do that review right there. Hope that light up feature with the suit looks pretty awesome. Uh, and we also have ooh, 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 some stuff from NECA. Awesome. So I ordered the Godzilla King of the Monsters Mothra. Had to pick up Mothra. So, and please let me know what you want to see reviewed most out of all the stuff I'm opening up over here. And then another piece from NECA Toys we have, and this was on, uh, I think this was on uh, part of a BBTS sale that I picked this up, but we have the good guys Chucky figure. I really like the packaging right here. I think that's brilliant. But yeah, so there's Chucky. I gotta have Chucky. I love watching Child's Play. And I can't remember how many of them there were, but I think I watched like this. I think I watched all of them, I'm not sure. Uh, and then, a lot of you guys have asked me to review this one right here. We have the SH Figure Arts Dragon Ball Super Broly Movies Broly. So now I have a canon Broly right here, and this is looking awesome. So I'm definitely going to have this one pitted up against my Vegito, or Gogeta. Sorry, my Gogeta. So that's sick. Ooh, looking really good. And another import figure. Uh, this was on one of the weekend deals that I picked up at BBTS. Really good price. Zero Suit Samus. I've wanted this forever. I've really wanted this for a very, very long time. Not a cheap figure, but it was on sale, and I was like, damn, I want it. So, there she is. Fantastic. I'm sure you guys don't care to see a review of this since it came out so long ago, but damn, it looks so good already. Very excited about that one. And then, a Star Wars Battle Droid. I had to pick up at least one of these. I'm probably going to get a couple more. 
But yeah, how to get a Star Wars battle droid. And then I, I do want to get the... There's a whole bunch of Star Wars figures that I still need to get. So I'm very excited about that. Oh man, alright. This is a big old box right over here. Oh jeez. And this is a big, 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 big package. Oh, knocking stuff over. Oh my goodness. Hey, don't get too excited now. Alright? I know you guys love watching my stuff fall over. But this is a huge box right over here from Jazzwares. So thank you so much, Jazzwares, for sending this out my way. I really appreciate it. Alright, so... Let's see what we got right here. Let's see what we got right here in this little box. I've been meaning to open this for a little bit now. Oh, 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 wow. I've never... Woo! What is this? Dang. All right. All right. It's a huge box within the box. So this is... Fortnite. Whoa. What a huge... Alright, got a big old promo box right over here. It says Fortnite on this side, and then you have a horse on that side. Fortnite again, nothing at the bottom. Cool, cool, cool. Let's open it up and see what's inside right here. Yes, alright. Bunch of Fortnite figures. So this is a 3 3 quarter inch uh, builder set right here. The with, uh, Is this the Black Knight, right? Is this one? Good. Yeah, Black Knight right there. It's pretty cool, right on, so you can build your fort. And then we have these six inch fully articulated figures, which, wow, okay. Uh, I haven't really seen these in person yet, and this looks pretty awesome. So this is the Rabbit Raider, looking dope. Wow, that looks really cool. Okay, okay, okay. Jazzware stepping up, man. The Enforcer, this looks really awesome. Man, a lot of accessories and everything with these, too. It's part of the Legendary series. And I got some gold right here around the text and stuff. That looks incredible. Jeez. We have, ooh, man, Havoc. That, this one could fit right in with the Marvel Legends display or anything. Wow. Is that even Tor articulation? I'm seeing Tor articulation on here, too. But, man, that looks really cool. Havoc. Wow. And then, oh, I've seen a lot of people talk about this one. Wild Card. This looks really good. I like the suited figure. It's Legendary Series. Legendary Series. <laughs> kind of funny. <laughs> and uh, Bobby Valla, who used to work for Hasbro and worked on a lot of our favorite Marvel Legends that have recently come out, like the Professor X figure and the most recent Spider-Man waves, he works for Jazzwares now. Uh, I wonder if he's part of coming up with that name. Maybe, maybe not. But uh, this is the Skull Trooper Purple Glow version. Looking awesome. I like that. I do have a Skull Trooper that's not Purple Glow, so I'm stoked to see that. And then lastly, we have the Visitor. 40 points of articulation, man. Is that finger articulation in there, too? Dude, I cannot wait to open this. Wow, this... Mm -hmm. Okay, um, I, I am impressed so far. So this is looking dope. Wow, man, Chazwares. I, I, it's like, they're kind of like that, uh, you remember back in the day when you are in grade school and there's that, like, nerdy, ugly chick, you know, who may have just been, like, too tall and too, I don't know, maybe just, like, too much braces and, and stuff and kind of goofy looking and you never really thought much of her and then all of a sudden uh, you run into her in high school and she's a bombshell and you're like, damn, what the hell? What the hell happened to, what was that, Mary Glacier, I was like, damn, what the hell, Mary, you're like, shit, she looked hella fine. And you're like, oh yeah, I got sick, and I was like throwing up for like two months straight, and then like, uh, I lost all this weight, and like, my teeth, I like, got my braces off, and all that stuff, and then I was like, wow, okay, that's kind of funny. But yeah, anyway, um, that's how I feel about Jazzwares right now, I'm like, whoa, damn, that's, that, pretty impressive. Pretty impressive already. But I can't wait to open these and see how they are. I won't be reviewing them until after San Diego Comic Con, obviously. But uh, yeah, let me know which one out of those you want me to review the most. All right, you guys? But I am impressed already. Again, if you want to send your letters and artwork, please go ahead and do so. Shardmas Prime, PO Box 384, Pacifica, California, 94044. And I will catch you guys later. Peace!